Good afternoon and welcome back to the Stylin Lounge. Stylin Steve here with you as always. It is time for another afternoon quarantine stream from the isolation station. Got it all out in one breath again. Go me. Steve Smith, welcome to the channel. Vibe Foo, thank you very much for the follow just as I was getting ready to go live. Thank you very much for that. I do appreciate it a lot. Uh, it is Thursday, April 23rd, 2020. If you need to figure out what day of the week it is in this topsy-turvy world that we're living in, it's actually a Thursday. Um, I missed that and didn't realize that today was my garbage day. Whoops! Fortunately, I have outside bins, so I put my garbage outside in the bin for next week. Um, <laughs> today... I'm playing some The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past Randomizer, as always. Gonna run through one seed first and see how long that takes me, because I will be playing uh, Minecraft later with my good friend, El Oresta. She's out in Cornerbrook, Newfoundland. We're gonna connect up on Discord and play some Minecraft, hopefully today, uh, build the iron farm we started last week, and probably gonna do some end busting and get some more shulker shells and stuff like that. Excuse me. But, up first, and I hope everyone is having a good day, um, up first, as always, is A Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past randomizer, as I bring up the game here. This is my uncle leaving the house. He just runs out the goddamn door, doesn't even say a word, into the rainy night. Ganon has shuffled all the items around Kryn. Kryn? Jesus, Hyrule. Kryn's an entirely different world. Um, <laughs> Jesus, if this took place on Kryn, there'd be a lot more dragons. Um, so this is The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past randomizer. All of the items are still in the game that would be in the vanilla game, but they've been shuffled around to different treasure chests throughout the world. My job is to find those to sort out the puzzle of the game, and as well, I'm doing a Triforce hunt. So above my health, there's going to be a little indicator that counts to 20. I need to find 20 pieces of Triforce to win the game. Don't need to beat all the dungeons, don't need to kill the big pig, I just gotta find those particular items. Now, I need to mute the desktop volume for just a minute, because this 2-bit hack cunt of a 2-bit wannabe techno remixed artist named Connor Mac, C-O-N-N-O-R-M-A-C, uh, decided to take the Fairy Fountain theme, 20 seconds of it under fair use, and um, put it in a crappy remixed want to be techno song uh, that he made and now as a result of that he thinks he can make copyright claims against people and mute their streams so he's a fucking asshole is what Connor Mac is C-O-N-N-O-R space M-A-C find him online, find him on YouTube find him on any social media platform you want call him a cunt, call him an asshole tell him to stop making these goddamn illegitimate claims because this is just the game that I'm playing, it's the music from the original game and Nintendo's copyright trumps his attempts. And that's my soapbox for today. So the Mighty Pung will return to save Hyrule. The Mighty Pung. And as soon as we start in his house... Ooh, Pung looks like Homer Simpson. Yep, me cursing. Hey, Al. Uh, we are going to start... I can bring back the desktop audio now. And we'll start in Pung's house and start my timer. And away we go. Homer's a little disturbing to watch. I like the Mighty Pung. In this case, the Mighty Homer Simpson. Hi, Chad. <laughs> Stupid guards. Five arrows. Have a good walk. I'll talk to you when you get back. So if everything works out right with the timing, uh, myself and Elle will be playing Minecraft later. For a good portion of the uh, of the evening. A bottle with a bee in it. I can go see the sick kid when I get to Kakariko Village. Guards are given hearts and arrows. <laughs> Ooh, power glove. If I get bombs, I can do the back of escape. I'm not even sure what his bunny sprite is. Can't wait to find that out. Oh, 
Might as well do the tree pull again. See what I get. Arrows for the second tier. Okay. everyone is having a good day today. It is a beautiful day here in St. John's. I was out for a drive earlier and got some gas. First time I've ever filled up my tank from near empty for only 30 bucks. Walmart Farmer has the power glove because now I'm playing... Yes, exactly. And if they did their work on the sprite right... I've noticed it on other sprites. Uh, I don't think it was done on Homer. Um, the other sprites, their hands actually change color as he gets the different gloves. Now, in Homer's case, when you get the Titan's mitt, how you'd know his hands are gold? I don't know. But they didn't turn gray with the power glove. Bombs? No bombs. Give me bombs. Heart. The golden donut. Have all the donuts in the world! Ah. Fuck that up. Okay. First piece of Triforce of the game. 19 to go. buy bombs when I get to Kakariko Village, although I've got 40 rupees right now, so that's not too bad. Oh, I forgot to put up my go live notifications. Shit. And Chad, I finally moved into this particular decade, century. Decade. Uh, I bought a new gaming system yesterday. For the first time since the PlayStation 1, I now own an actual game system. Flute. Sweet. Activate that when I get to Kakariko. Yeah, I bought a Switch. And I've got uh, an Elgato capture card on the way for it, so I'll be able to stream the games. Some Animal Crossing, and I bought Mario Kart 8, so... I can start playing some online Mario Kart. Yeah, well, I put it that way on purpose. I didn't outright say I have a Switch with, like, the usual pomp and circumstance that I would do. What are you going to give me? Hearts. Oh. What's on the waterfall? Piece of heart. Okay. And let me tell you, I've been having a lot of fun in Animal Crossing from last night into this morning. It's actually a pretty decent game. That's not to understand. You clean up an island, you build a home, you invite friends over, you grow crops. It's kind of like Minecraft. Then it becomes like the real world, because there's this one shyster trying to exploit you for everything you're worth. Two pieces of dry horse. Sweet! Tom Nook is an underhanded criminal, and I'm going to expose him. And another five bucks. Tom Nook, Tom Nook is a mafia... Uh, is a mafioso. No, I didn't. That's not what I said at all, you twister of words. It was not implied. 
That is never implied. Thank you very much. Because one of these days, somebody's going to open up your head and we're going to find a dead hamster with a half-eaten Necco wafer. And that's what's in your head. Three pieces of Triforce. The Titan's Mitts. Nice. Four pieces of Triforce. And 20 bucks. Three hundred rupees, okay. I'll take three hundred. <laughs> After I see the bottle vendor I'll be down to three thirty six, so I'm trying to work my way up to Zora money. <laughs> Don't you mean the hamster was scooped out? The poor thing was dead. Fifty rupees. Kinda like seeing rupees. Miscarade, thank you very much for the five bits. And hello, how are you today? The lamp. Bomb refill. And the flippers. Sweet. Well, the early bird gets the worm. Or the second mouse gets the cheese. I prefer that one. The boots! Oh my god. Activate the lamp while I'm here. I've got my dark roll access. I just need the moon pearl. Doritos most definitely count. You're off to a good start. So Swag Duck Airlines is flying. They're even better than Dodo Airlines. Just a little piece of love. I need to get more bombs. I will go get more bombs after I do my my next couple of checks. Sick kid, you poor little bastard stuck in bed. What do you got? Just a little piece of love. It's great to shop online and plan it all out. Um, Next time I do it, I might do curbside pickup instead of delivery. Uh, I had way too many substitutions because when I ordered delivery off Instacart, the shopper that they assigned um, only shops at Dominion and CVS, and apparently they don't carry the same stuff that Dominion and Mount Pearl does. So I'm going to order a curbside pickup. Oh, the rats aren't giving anything today. There's ten. I can't do I can't do Costco. I don't. I if uh, I want anything from Costco, I have to ask my sister to, or my mother to get it for me because I don't have a Costco membership. So might now might be the perfect time to get one. Sign up for a year for now. I might do that actually. Piece of Triforce. I'm up to five pieces of Triforce. Sweet.
The only thing I miss about Costco is the giant tubs of cheese balls. They last me about four days. It's good. <laughs> That big piece of her glass. Well, the Costco canteen was good, I'll give it that. Now it's too far out to enjoy unless you're actually going on the excursion up there. The Red Meringue. Probably won't. Uh, there we go. That P will, though. As I empty out the dam. Twenty bucks. Well, it counts towards our money, so yes, I am okay with that. I am 47 rupees short of my Zora money. Let's see if I can get it here. Yes, I am Homer. It really helps Zora gives me 20 rupees. Mm -hmm. Two little pieces of love, a bomb refill, full heart container, and blue mail. So now he's working man Homer. He's gone from his green pants to his blue pants. We moved from season one to season two onward. Oh, I can see what my stun prize is now, too. Hurts. Okay. A bomb? Sweet. Don't need the hearse. Well, easiest thing to do with the, with the crabs is to kill them that way. I don't even know what that thing is. Nope, no rupees. Oh sure, the crabs are giving arrows. Bastards. I know how to get money. The hook shot, sweet. So I can get to Death Mountain, I can do East Death Mountain, I can do all the Dark Death Mountain. Hello, pastry gal, how are you today? Hope you're having a good day. Impressive yours didn't. Rupees. Time to go talk to King Zora and see what valuable life lesson he wants to teach me today. Don't listen to chat. <laughs> oh, 
I go into the grocery store with a plan in mind, and I really do my best to not deviate from it. And I usually succeed. Except for adding in, like, a box of popcorn or a bag of pretzels. More bombs. Thanks for nothing, asshole. Oh, shit. Oh, good, it didn't do the water walk. <laughs> Not trying to hit the water walk or the fake flipper, it, it does it. When I don't want to hit it, <laughs> or when I do want to hit it, <laughs> it takes me four or five tries. Swim, you fat bald bastard. Six pieces of dry horse, and my first shield brought to me by Fisher Price. What's on the ledge? Twenty bucks. Chad, you got part of your wish. There's just 20 bucks on the ledge that I don't need. Uh... Four and a half hours last night, and two or three hours this morning. He did give me 20 bucks. He gave me 20 bucks. Start from my house. Yeah, I got four hours in last night and a couple hours this morning, so about six or seven hours. And I had my island gate open this morning, so a friend of mine stopped by and she gave me... Uh, cherries and oranges and bamboo. <laughs> yeah, I got a switch. You, you, how? Miss Corey, you know damn well I have a switch. You added me as a friend code last night. You added a Nintendo account? Yes, I picked up a switch yesterday. How did you think I was playing Animal Crossing without a switch? <laughs> you are tired. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. There's the key, so I wouldn't need that to move on. Oh, my goal still says I want to switch. I'm going to change that. Steve's pandering. He wants to switch. Steve's pandering. He has to pay off his switch. No. <laughs> I don't know what to make the next bit go. Where in the name of... There it is. I'll have to change that. I'll just call it April Bickle. I always miss something when I'm setting up my stream. Alright, in the back of escape I've got bombs, ten arrows, and a piece of Triforce. Sweet.
And my Earth Day guy is selling hibiscus today. So once I open the gate again, people can come in and, and buy that if they want. Let's go take the old man up to Death Mountain. I, I closed the gate um, just before I started streaming. Into Bonk Rocks I go. For ten arrows. Useless bastards. Save Gary the old man. I don't have the mirror, but I can do the other side. I can do East Death Mountain because I got the hookshot. Somebody was in a hurry upstairs. Didn't even take off the roots when they were upstairs. bombs. Thanks, Gary, for being useless. Zimby, how are you? Hope you're having a good day, my friend. Thanks for the follow last night. Glad you could stop by today. Going good. Having a pretty good morning. Played some Animal Crossing offline, and now I'm streaming my Zelda. 20 rupees. Hope you're having a really good day. Canaburna. Uh, I'll get it. I want it for the blind fight. Uh. And I'm looking forward to playing some Minecraft later with a friend. We're going on the Bedrock server to build an iron farm and do some end busting. So I'm going to conquer my fear of the end. Canaburna. Piece of Heart is an Eastern Palace. Whoa, that's Samaria. Burna. Yes, the sheep will be shown off. Well, we're going on after I finish Link and we're... Um, hopping on Discord and just having an adventure. I'm lucky I got the motivation to build the iron farm. Usually, I, I just, um, usually I just go on, adjust my farms and fish. Link is <laughs> Simpson, Homer J. Uh, the randomizer lets you pick from about a hundred different sprites that you can use, and for this particular game, I picked Homer. Depending on how quick this seed goes, I have a second one lined up, and it's got a different sprite that I can use. Uh, there's a Sonic the Hedgehog I might try at some point yet. There's... Um, what I think is one of the funnier ones, or one of the best ones that I've used, is uh, a totem of Lynx. It's three Lynx stood on each other's heads. It's the guys from um, Triforce Heroes. That reminds me, I had to remember it was Triforce Heroes. Where's Angry Spud today? The guys who built, who put together the randomizer put an awful lot of work into making it amazing. Ten pieces of hearth, eight pieces of Triforce, nine pieces of Triforce. I need those to win the game, I got nine of twenty, there's the Cane of Samaria, and the Cape. Can Samaria and the Cape. Shit. Lamp, Cape, Dead Wizard. Hmm. Mm. 
one of the tips and tricks of the game is a bomb jump. I have the hookshot. Fuck you, Moldorm. Now, I don't have the hammer, so I can't get over to see the Tower of Hera. What's up there? There's the... <laughs> I don't have the hammer, so I can't get to the Tower of Hera. Oh my god, I'm dead rocked. I'm completely dead rocked. Frick. I need the hammer. In order to get the hammer, I need the mirror. I don't even have the moon pearl yet, do I? No, I don't. Bow and arrow. Sweet. <laughs> have fun with lurking, Chad. Um, my house. Head over and have a look at Eastern Palace. I gotta do a, a map check, too, and see what crystals are where. Because I haven't done that yet. Okay, Desert uh, Eastern Palace is a crystal. Desert Palace is a crystal. Tower of Hera is a pendant. Oh my god, Zimbi, thank you so much for the 250 bits, man. That's awesome. I do appreciate it a lot. I gotta update that while I'm stuck here. Uh, all widgets. Bit goal. Biddy hype. I can't update that without getting rid of it. So it's going to say Pandering Steve wants a switch for now. Until tomorrow. Because i got to delete it and put it back. Okay. Yeah, I'd have to delete the goal and put it back. I'm not going to do that right now in the middle. Hype, 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 hype. Love my hype emote from Smashly Draws. It is awesome. Back in we go. Get out of there. Over to Eastern Palace, and I can finish the Eastern Palace because I have everything I need. Can you believe we're only seven days away from May? Feels like just yesterday I got quarantined. Green Pendant is in Thieves Town. What time is uh, time is an illusion. Lunchtime doubly so. Half magic, sweet. And a piece of Triforce. I am now halfway done the Triforce hunt. And what's the tracker at? 30 minutes. Timer, sorry. People assume that time is a series of cause and cause event, when in reality it's more like a big ball of wibbly wobbly timey wimey stuff. That sentence got away from me. Yeah, that one kind of got away from me a bit. People assume that time is a progression of cause and effect. Yeah, okay, that's right. I have an open challenge on Mario Kart 8 now from a friend of mine. I bought Mario Kart 8 after an addition to um, Animal Crossing. And a friend of mine just messaged me. She said, let me know if you get Mario Kart 8 so I can kick your ass. I'm gonna save those races till I get the Elgato in. And 
that's gonna be fun too. Online Mario Kart races. Just to see how bad I actually am at the game. Zimby would not believe the amount of Doctor Who knowledge locked inside my brain. Oh, I'd say it'll be dreadful when I get online. Like, um, humble brag time. <laughs> it was the one video game I was good at. And if Chad is still listening, he won't dispute that. He's known me close on 30 years. When my nephews first got their Switch, they got Mario Kart 8 with it, and I went over and I was playing against either, both of them taking turns. And at one point they stopped and looked at their mother and said, Mom, can you just come here and beat Uncle Steve? And she said, No, I never could. But when you get into the online players and people who spend a lot of time researching what's good and what's bad... <laughs> Video game confession, I have never finished Super Mario Brothers. But I'm kick ass at Mario Kart. Tetris, I think, is in my Nintendo Entertainment System pack, because I bought the Club Nintendo subscription. And I may end up wasting a lot of time in Tetris. My stun prizes hurts, that's right. No, I need that. Just a little piece of love. Now, to see what the anti fairies are going to do. Nope. Nope. Ah, fuck. Now, according to different people that I've talked to, because I was thinking of either getting Mario Kart or getting Splatoon 2, um, the Mario Kart scene is a lot less toxic. So I said, well, I'll go with that. I'm all in favor of not toxic. See, magic was another one I, di I didn't really care about being the best or finishing on top. I just liked having a good, fun game. Like, I'd show up to the tournaments over at Mon with a goblin deck. Knowing full well that a goblin deck is not going to do anything in the tournament so that used to be over at Mon. But I'd have fun. See the worst. Yep. Oh, three shots missed. Get me out of here. shots left. I better make him count. Jesus. There we go.
Jesus, Homer looks happy. <laughs> deck I put together was an M11 deck um, that was red and blue and the red was nothing but pure fire damage the blue was all counter spells and most of the counter spell spells caused mill damage as well so I call it my burn counter fuck you deck and I had fun with it like when you get a guy who comes at you with like a zombie dealing five damage and you say okay cool on your turn discard half your di discard half your library and he goes what? <laughs> you know, that's the fun of that, fun of those. Uh, Swag Duck Airlines, where are we gonna go? I don't have a Moon Pearl. I don't have the Mushroom. I've been to Zora. If I go into the Dark World, I can't do anything there. I've been over to, oh, Agina. Let's see if Agina has it. So that's on Desert Ledge. Piece of heart. <laughs> I once had a deck that was a pure blue deck that was nothing but counter spells and four creatures. The four creatures were the Prodigal Sorcerer and the Zurin Spellcaster, four of each. And I took a guy from 100 hit points down to none just by pinging him for eight hit points every round. Okay, I gotta think for a second. Eastern Palace is done, Back of Escape is done, Bonk Rocks is done. Oh, King's Tomb. But, like, I'll make the weird decks. I'm, you know, I'm having fun. I'm enjoying the game, which is what you're supposed to do. Not, I don't get 100% competitive. I don't, you know, I don't get extremely pissed off if I lose. I don't, no, I'm having fun. of Risk. It's the Star Wars Clone Wars edition that I've only ever opened. I've never played it. I've had no one to play the game with. Fire Source Gloves. I can beat deserts. What in the name of Christ is going on? Who'll play? Who'll take England and Australia, and then for no apparent reason at all, I'll take Luxembourg just to have something in the middle. But you can't win from there. Oh, you think I'm trying to win? I'm just trying to fuck you up. You appear to be under the misunderstanding that I'm trying to win. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
even playing chess, I'm not playing to win. <laughs> a lot of times I'm playing for a draw. Shit, now I gotta deal with him. Moon Pearl! Sweet! Okay, now I'm happy. Now I can do a lot more in the Dark World. I can do everything in the Dark World. I need the mirror, actually, so I can get my hammer. There's the big key. See, if I had the mirror, I wouldn't even have to run back, because inside a, dun a dungeon you can activate the mirror and it'll take you back to the entrance you came in. Not that it's taking Homer that long anyway, because he runs. I need three hearts. Bombs, that was not what I wanted. <laughs> there are some hearts. There go the hearts. sword. What's down here? A little piece of heart. Right. Oh, this dungeon's gonna be a little harder to finish because I just have the fighter sword. See what I can do here. Missed it. Short hopper, fucker. considering my aim. I'm gonna keep getting hit. There. That wasn't a bad fight, all things considered. Compass. Desert Palace is done. Still at 10 pieces of Triforce, so there's no extra Triforce in here for me.
calling Swag Duck Airlines. Party of one. Now departing the desert of, mo of misery, heading to Death Mountain. Now arriving, Death Mountain. And once I go into the dark world, there is no way back for me. So I'm gonna have to save and quit once I'm done. Uh, four, six checks in here. around there to take me down. I need the mirror is what I really need. Because the mirror lets me jump back and forth between the dark world and the light world. Shit, missed that one. So this is what they call Super Bunny Cave, because at the time you get here in the original game, you were you don't have the Moon Pearl, you're in your in your bunny form, you're a bunny. And falling down that hole actually lets you open chests. Ten arrows and a heart container. Although my hearts are in a good spot to take care of blind if I got to. And I can see what it takes to open up Turtle Rock. Let's go have a look. Ether medallion. So if you look on the tracker screen in the bottom right, where I keep track of all my items, there's now a TR over one of the medallions. That means that's the, the one that opens up Turtle Rock. Down in Turtle Rock. 20 rupees. 20 rupees. Bookshot Cave is not helping. Piece of Triforce. I'm at 11. Okay. I got half magic, don't I? Yes, I do. Okay. Three hearts of damage. Ouch. Out front of Ganon's tower. I can't do Spike Cave because I don't have a hammer. Never mind. Save and quit. <laughs> the things you remember. Uh, we'll start from the sanctuary, and I'm gonna go into what was Kakariko Village. Well, I'm gonna go into Kakariko Village, and then go into the Village of Outcasts, which is Kakariko in the Dark World. Ganon has split this world in twain. Run, you little homer, run. Uh, over this way. First look at the Dark World. Palace of Darkness is a crystal. Swamp Palace is a crystal. Skull Woods is a pendant. Thieves Town is a pendant. The Ice Palace is a good crystal. Misery Mire is the other one. And Turtle Rock is a crystal. Okay. So the Dark World is all mapped out. I'll get to that later. Okay. 
So, I don't need, well, <clears throat> they're saying I don't need to do a dungeon because it's, it's a pendant and it's less weighty than a crystal, but I need to find the pieces of Triforce. And they can be literally anywhere. So, I'm gonna go up and explore what I can of Spell Woods first. Things are a lot harder with just the fighter sword. Uh, Samario, so are you too? Getting a lot better at that. The map. Okay. That was not what I wanted to do, but okay, I'll take it. Got me back to my door. <laughs> pieces of dry horse so far. Do I have... I don't have the big key yet. That was a little close, but I got out of it. There's the big key. And the red monster fell away. Come on, boys. Come on. Come on. So I have one more chest to check in Spell Woods, and that's the big chest. And let's do it this way, shall we? There's the Ether Medallion. And I'm done in Skull Woods for what I can do. And that was a little showing off of the skills that I have learned playing this game. Watch enough speed as you learn things. And I still don't have a mirror, so I can't do... okay. Pick a chest. Any chest at all. The first one is crap, and the second one will give you what you want. Let's do that one way. Thirteen pieces of Triforce. Doing good. We need seven to go. Alright, let's see if we can get the seven. Whoa! Open up these two. And I'll go break into a house over here. Full complement of arrows again, I will live with. Excuse me.
into the brewery. 14 pieces of Triforce. Six to go. Hey, Seth. Hope you're having a good day, my friend. On such a beautiful day outside. Sucks that you don't have the Jeep yet, but you get it back tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow is just as beautiful out. Oh, I get to see what Homer, Homer's um, bunny form is. Every character, when they go into the Dark World, uh, if they don't have the Moon Pearl, they go into what is called their bunny form. It's named after Link because he turns into a bunny. And in this dungeon are magic things that turn you into your bunny form. So now we get to see what happens to the Homer sprite. Homer becomes... Evil Homer. I am Evil Homer. I am Evil Homer. Compass. Doing the Irish loop. Nice. Mushroom. There's a few spots down there you can get a couple of really nice pulls when you're going down the road. Not that I've ever done it. You know. I'm just saying. <laughs> Sunday and ended up, well, we did the Irish Loop one week, um, and another week we ended up in Greats Cove, which the road to Greats Cove is amazing. There is nothing on that, on that so-called highway for miles, and uh, at one point we just hammer down. How much can this car hammer down? Because it was just a straight, open stretch of road for several miles. Mm-hmm. It was pretty cool. out in my favor. <laughs> Bomb error in my favor. I don't have the hammer. I gotta leave something behind. If I get a small key in this next chest, I'm leaving something behind. If I don't get a small key, then it's locked in the big chest. I got my mirror. Sweet. That's even better. So there's the big key is locked behind itself. Or the big key I have but the small key to access it is locked inside the big key chest. Which is just the way Rando works. I got my mirror. Oh my fuck. Thank you. I can do a whole shitload more checks. I can get my hammer now, too. Uh, fire sword. Let's get that out for when we need it. What's Blind's pun today? Being crushed by big objects is depressing. Oh. 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 
I'm not on script. I'm off script. up, I'm activating the cane. That fight got away from me. So that's Thieves Town done, and that is my 15th piece of Triforce. I only need five more pieces of Triforce to win the game. Now I'm going to take a slight detour back into, <clears throat> excuse me, it's back up Death Mountain because there's stuff I need to do with the hammer. So. Swag Duck Airlines, party of one. Sweet Fanny Adam, anyway. I was looking for an excuse to use that expression, and we just got it. Now, for my favorite trick in the game the mirror. This particular spot, I cannot mirror back to the entrance, so if I go to push a block that can be pushed, it deletes the block from the game. some water. People are letting me down. There's a hydrate command. And as of today, there's a new command. If you go exclamation point switch, it'll give you my friend code for my Nintendo Switch for when I'm playing Animal Crossing. Or Mario Kart when I start playing online against people. Pastry guy redeems hydrate. <laughs> no inebriate today. I gotta put in a liquor order. Although I do still have some left, and I got a half case of beer out there and two cans of Guinness. Yay, my hammer! Swag Duck Airlines now boarding, heading for Kakariko Village. The goose is loose, the pheasant is present, the duck is run amok, the squab is on the job, and any other bird-related puns you can think of. Absolutely. All right, hammer dash. There we go. 
Gamble a thousand. Sorry, Seth. 36 is a loss. Hey, the ice rod. Sweet. Uh, that actually helps. Stupid chicken. Now, I got rid of my magic for a reason. Um... Sorry, pastry gal. <laughs> Gambling does not want to be kind this today, this morning, this afternoon. The red mail. Now, normally when you come over here, gambles on cooldown. Jesus, I gotta lower that. I, I don't think I can lower that cooldown. Uh, there we go. Normally when you come into Magic Bat, you need the powder with you in order to wake him up. I have the Mushroom and the Cane of Samaria. There's a glitch in the game that when I go to use this cane with no magic, if I can hit the... hit the... use it, have the air go off, the air sounds up, and then hit the Mushroom, I can trick the bat into coming out. takes a couple of tries for me to do it. Shit. Come on, I can fake powder with the with the worst of them. Fake powder, mean. Got him. All that for a little piece of love. Okay. <laughs> and I can get more magic in a minute because I'm going to go over to uh, the witch's hut and turn in the mushroom. So Jeremiah's gone home. I will grab Gary's lunchbox and we're gonna go open that. And I got some stops to make along the way. 275 seconds, that's like, yeesh. There's almost a five minute cooldown on that. Let's see if I can lower that. It is excessive. There's nobody following me. Come on. Leave you down there. Shit. Frig you, dig game. finish this seed, I'll go have a look and see what's going on with the cooldowns and see if I can change them or adjust them. Sixteen pieces of Triforce. Four to go. I'm gonna say Nad shot and see how close I get, but thank you very much for the follow. Ric Flair going off scared me just then. <laughs> I did not want a mirror. I don't 
don't have the shovel, so I can't mirror. Welcome to the Style and Lounge. Hope you enjoy your stay here. A little piece of love. Currently I'm playing The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. Randomizer. Uh, every item is still in the game where, ch where you would think, but it is randomized throughout the world, so different items appear in different chests. And I'm doing a Triforce hunt. To win the game, I need to find 20 pieces of Triforce that have been scattered throughout the world. I'm working on 16, so I need to find four more. Master Sword. I will take it. <laughs> Sorry, Seth. Well, you saw me jump. <laughs> oh, good. I can check Bombos now. Nothing wrong with a little Ric Flair styling and profiling. Woo! The jet flying, limousine riding, wheeling, dealing, kiss stealing, son of a gun! 17 pieces of Triforce. Three more I need. Hope there wasn't much coffee in your coffee. Oh, I can check Hype Cave now, too. Triforce. I only need two more. Not the green goo. My fire shield. 19 pieces of Triforce. I'm gonna go back over and do the dig game. One more piece of Triforce to win the game. between me and the end of the game. Just the single rupee. That's insulting. The best sound I've got going hasn't even been found yet. Nobody has set off the best sound in the game yet. Or the game in the in my stream. Or what I think is the best sound in the game anyway. Or game in the stream. I spent. I'm the one that put together the the sounds and the and the little videos that happen. Catfish, what do you got for me? Twenty pieces of dry horse. Done. Save and quit. El Roesta, are you there? Are you back from your run, walk, whatever you were doing, or are you still lurking? Thank you. 
Game. 117.46. Not bad. Can you please break us three up? Thanks. Sassy Ralph's homecoming. They can't say Sahas Rala. You don't have that much. Exclamation point points will tell you how much you have. You can't have that much. Yeah. Um. Gamble. That's allowing everybody to gamble. Fungus for life. The wood fellas, like they would be. Wise boy has triangle again, so there was a piece buried if I'd found the shovel. Love chain, God lover. The dwarven breadsmiths, look at them hammer that bread out. Sleeps again forever. 